Okay. Keep going. <laughs> Don't walk towards the height. Just go that direction. Okay, he's up. Keep on your back, baby. Can't make it too clean. Or think about it. Because he's willing to do it now that he got you to help him. Not that he needed it, but he wanted to control. Just holding where you're at. Okay, now very subtly, just turn and look at us this way. There you go. Wait till he passes you, because he's going to, and then step off and walk towards us. Watch the dog oh. out of the corner of your eye, though. Don't turn towards him. <laughs> he's working it, though. The wind was blowing this way, now it just shifted and blowing the other way. Yeah. Watch him. He'll react. You'll see him react. Yeah, he's looking like What the hell happened to the owner? <laughs> Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. This is the communication you want to learn. <coughs> if you had two or three other dogs out here loose, that dog's communication right now would have three of them all running over there because they already know he's looking. If he looks at you, step in just slightly to give him some support. Okay, there it is. Step in. You gotta tell him, yeah, I think you're right, bud. <laughs> and now he's upwind. Chasing it out. <clears throat> He's going to come back. Here he comes. He's going to make a decision. Step forward. Step forward. You got to time that stepping because that's his re. Right away, he says, what do you think? you got to say something to him, not verbally. Okay, he's getting ready to do it. Step in. Yes. Good. Now reward higher. Reward higher. No, no. Hold it up there. Hold it right at that reward, up at the source. There you go, until he gets frustrated. Wait a minute. When he whistles a third stanza of Dixie, then you're going to feed him. Good oh, boy. Yeah. Now you feed him. Good. Nice. nice. All right, you can bring him on out when you're ready. That's good. That's good. That's, can you just, I'll do it. Yeah, let's put your, pull it about two inches too short for it.